what's up thanks for coming back to this little corner of the internet so today you know I was feeling a little bit bored of my routine um, I've been doing the same thing especially now that we're in self-isolation routine is really important like especially now more than ever because if you don't have a routine especially when you're just stuck at home all day the motivation just like slips slips out of your hands it's really hard to catch her again and get that motivation back again i thought you know what i'm gonna do someone else's morning routine just to switch it up a little bit and maybe adopt new habits you know that i find that oh my gosh this is actually amazing i'm gonna keep doing this so I thought it would be really cool and fun if I followed a YouTuber's morning routine. So I decided to follow Natalie Barbu's morning routine. I have been watching Natalie for so freaking long since she started college, I'm pretty sure. And we're the same age, so I always felt like I could relate to her. I freaking love this girl. She's really cool. Her vlogs always motivate me to just get off my booty and um, get things done. Um, or to take time off as needed, you know, she really does a good job of advocating for both sides of life, you know, but I decided I'm gonna follow one of her morning routines, uh, her morning routines in quarantine or in self-isolation. Um, I'll leave the video that I'm following down below. So this day she, I think she vlogged the entire day, but I'm just following her morning section of her vlog. So as you probably saw in the beginning, if I do edit this video the way I have it in my head right now, um, then you saw that I made my bed. I usually make my bed anyways, um, and I know Natalie's always talking about making your bed. Highly recommend doing that. It really does make a huge difference in your, in your day. Just like the fact that you made your bed, you're like, okay, the bed sheets are closed. I'm not getting back in it. Again, open up the curtains, open up the blinds, let the light in. Now, put on my workout clothes, and this is the part that's actually different than what I usually do. Um, I love working out, so the working out part is not weird. And I know how she always talks about that she works out before she eats breakfast, and that's actually very different for me because I wake up hungry. Um, right now, I'm actually okay because I had a good, I had a good dinner, which is I'm going to attempt to work out in the morning. I used to do this in college. Um, like a year and a half, two years ago. Um, but I haven't really done that since. I usually get up, make breakfast, eat, get work done, and then work out in the evening. Um, but I'm gonna try this out. I'm gonna see if I like it. If I do, I might, you know, keep doing this. But I'm gonna do that and then eat breakfast. So, let's do it. Just the other day, saw you looking my way. I start to contemplate moments that went to waste. I, why you do that? You drop me like who that? And put me through that? My baby is useless. I'm living my life. Don't need you in mind. Me feeling just fine. One of a kind. Who better than I? I, 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 I. Shout it, don't play that game. Shout it, don't play that game. Okay, so my workout is done. I'm not gonna lie, I'm so hungry. Um, but I really, like overall working out first thing in the morning, I really like it. I forgot how much it energizes me. I think I wake up stressed with how much I need to do and I just wanna get started on my work. But I think working out in the morning before doing anything is kind of like giving yourself that little you time before you're giving yourself to your work, if that makes sense. I feel good, I feel energized, I feel ready to take on the day, but I'm ready to eat. <laughs> um, so usually for breakfast, I'll have like oatmeal or something. Um, in Natalie's video, she had, I think her sister was making a smoothie, but I think I'm gonna do, um, just from watching her previous vlogs, I know she also does uh, eggs, like sunny side up eggs with spinach. She likes saute some spinach. Um, and I think she said she adds garlic to it. So I'm gonna try that out. I have been wanting to actually try like sauteed spinach with egg in the mornings. And also, oh my God, this is like apart from the morning routine, but I was so excited because I finally did a hit headstand. Um, obviously with, well, with assistance from the wall. Um, but usually my mom, 
I look so pale right now. Um, usually my mom helps me do my headstands. Like she'll like hold my legs up, but I did it alone. It's crazy because like I was scared to do it. And then I just said, you know what, Greta, just have faith, kick your legs off of the floor. And I did. And that's what happened. So that just shows you, you just got to have a little bit of faith, believe in yourself. Yes, that is my motivational talk for the morning. But I'm going to go, this lighting is just all kinds of crazy. I'm going to go make breakfast and then get my day started. They're outside. They're watching my video. Oh my god, so cute. Barbu fashion. We're gonna make a Nespresso. I'm kind of craving the iced coffee, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make it and then I'm gonna put it in the fridge while I like get ready, shower, all that kind of stuff. And when I come down, she will be nice and cold and ready for the ice, okay? Okay, so we are showered. My face is hella dry. So can you guys hear the music? They like refuse to turn it down. So I am gonna put on this little guy. I love this stuff. So now we are gonna put on that sunscreen. Don't forget your sunscreen, ladies and gentlemen. Very, very, very important. Then I have really, really, really thick curly hair. So I have to brush it out. And then, that was <laughs> so smooth. Um, I'm gonna put on this Cantu Shea Butter Coconut Curly Cream. This stuff is really heavy duty for hair that is super, 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 super thick uh, and curly. Look at that product. I'm just gonna put it all over my hair. So this part is not actually like shown in her morning routine, but I just wanted to show you what I'm using for when I get ready, but like not fully ready because I'm not really gonna be wearing makeup today. Um, which she also said in her video, she mentioned how she feels most ready when she just puts on a normal outfit and I'm kind of the same way. Makeup, like putting a full face of makeup doesn't really make or break like my motivation or how I'm feeling, um, I don't know, or how ready I feel like I am, um, but it's mainly my outfit. If you saw my last video, then you know I am obsessed with this stuff, the Clarins Lip Treatment Oil. Girl, I love this stuff. I could marry this tube of lip gloss. Let me show you my outfit real quick because I know you're dying to know. delicious iced cafe and now 
Natalie suggests, which I highly also recommend, is to find a dedicated workspace to get your work done. So for me, I'm lucky enough to have a little desk in my room. I am obsessed with my little corner. <laughs> Um, I feel really focused here. Sometimes I'll go to the dining room and I'll work a little bit, but that can get a little distracting because people are coming in and out and then like my mom comes downstairs and my dad comes in and it's like everybody wants to come hang out. I know Natalie, she talks a lot about her Google Calendar and I've actually been implementing my Google Calendar a lot because of her. Um, I just really... I don't know, I just think it looks really clean. I also still use my bullet journal. I've talked about my bullet journal so much, you're probably so annoyed with me talking about it. And she also talks about in her videos how she structures her days by hour. Um, I don't know if she does that every day, but that's also been really helpful, especially working from home and just being essentially stuck at home. Right now I'm looking for jobs. <laughs> which is so fun during a pandemic. I mean, we love that. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna get to work for a little bit and yeah, I don't know what else to say. I wanted to end this video kind of like in a more formal setting because I just wanted to talk about what I thought about Natalie's um, morning routine because it is very much the afternoon right now. And overall, I freaking loved it. I really loved working out in the morning. I felt like it gave me so much energy. I think that's the biggest takeaway from this morning routine was working out in the morning versus at night. I just felt so motivated and it's so nice to know like, I already got my workout done. The breakfast was so good. We made my coffee. The coffee in the work part is very, um, very normal for me, um, but just having the dedicated workspace versus working downstairs in my dining room where literally everyone passes through and it's like super distracting. I really enjoyed working in my room. So thanks so much for watching again. Love Natalie, love her videos, highly recommend watching her. She actually lives in New York City. Um, I think right now she's at home in Charlotte, but I love her New York City content. I am waiting to move to New York City one day. So when I do, you will see my New York City content. Um, but yeah, I'll leave all her stuff in the description box. I'll see you in my next video and bye. Shasta, say hi. She's, she's just sleeping. All, all she ever does is sleep. Okay, bye. <laughs>